Next up on the Sage 2020 Showcase, we have Sonic 2.5. This is a fan game that aims to mix elements of Sonic 2 and Sonic 3 together, which I guess is why it's 2.5. Technically, wouldn't that make it Sonic 5 if we want to start doing weird math with it? Well, anyways, this version is a small level. Just one level. Okay. Also, I can tell you right now, this is made in the Pico 8 uh, quote-unquote console. Pico 8 is a development kit that I think runs in HTML5, and you can easily embed it on websites. You can easily make games with it. And it's just this cool little thing. Check out check out Pico 8 by just typing it into Google if you're curious. It's a really cool little thing. Oftentimes, very low resolution. It kind of has a focus on low resolution uh, uh, graphics, but it's pretty cool. I do quite a bit. I have Potter doing a Pico 8, like, stream. Just checking out Pico 8 games at some point. It's been an idea, anyways. Whoa, whoa, I wasn't expecting... Oh, hello. End of demo. Wait, literally? But... But I, like, played for, like, five seconds. Well, I guess he's not wrong when he says it's a very small level. It's a fancy console, yeah. It's a it's a cute fancy console thing. I guess I'll go down here. Sweet shoes. No music for him, but never mind. It just took a second. Is there anything down here, or probably death? Well, no, but that's not his death. Yeah, it's, oh, it's pain. It's pain. Well, there you go. Not even a, there. Very short game. How quickly can I beat this? You think? Faster. That's that actually good. No, I'm gonna see like the best. I'm gonna. I'm gonna speed run this. Because it's literally so sure you may as well. Okay, could definitely go faster than that. That's like I do better than 14 seconds. <laughs> 10 seconds? I think that's possible. Absolutely. I'm not much of a speedrunner. You get the jumps just right though, and this would be pretty fast. <laughs> Just oh god, I like glitched Sonic there for a second. Yeah, perfectly placed jumps, and you can basically just keep going. I found my speedrun game. You, just, you need to slow down a little bit after the first, after the second jump, or you or you go to or just jump early, and then jump down here. Make sure you jump down there. Like you need to go, you need to go down. It's down is good. Well, I was 11. That's definitely better. I can do better than that. It's per You have to be perfect, though. This is literally the entire enjoyment I can get out of this game. Give me a minute. <laughs> Jumping too late. I actually wonder, would it be faster to go through the loop? Because then you get a bunch of speed and... Actually, you lose it all. Hold on a minute. Testy side. Yeah, because if you get a bunch of speed, you can just... Bounce your way over. So actually, it would be good to go fast. I like how when I reset the card, it like literally does glitch out a bit. <laughs> well, that's how. That's a pretty. Oh my god, what did I do? <laughs> Why is it yellow? That's fine. Huh. 
<laughs> I think you can break things. Nine seconds! I'm gonna I'm gonna call it there. Nine fucking seconds. You could probably beat that, but it's gonna be a tricky. That's I'm gonna stick to that as my PB, yeah. <laughs> Try being that if you want. If you play this, because literally that's nothing else to play here. This is too short to review. So I speedrunned it for fun. There, nine sec literally a nine second game. There's not much I can say about it. That was like 2.5. I, I I mean, let me know when you develop more. The problem with the Pico 8 is that it's kind of limited in how much you can put into the game, I think. Like, I think there's a memory limit for the Pico 8. I'm not sure, though. But, I mean, I guess keep working on it, dude. It looks fine. Like, graphically, it looks just fine. It plays just fine, too. Like, but there's nothing here, so. Good start. Now put something more interesting. Now put something more substantial together. That's Sonic 2.5, my basic opinion of it.